Welcome back. We are taking a live look now from Galveston, Texas, as the Gulf Coast prepares for the impacts from Hurricane Delta. And you can already see there, it is looking gloomy. The waves are big. It's just what we see during hurricane season. Meanwhile, multiple linemen from here in Central Florida are on the way to Louisiana right now. We were there as Duke Energy crews left this morning. News 6's Ezzie Castro explains why this is not their first appointment this hurricane season. For the fourth time this year, Duke Energy is sending crews to the Gulf Coast, this time to help residents during Hurricane Delta. We love what we do. It, it gets a good feeling in us when we go ahead and get the lights back on. Robert Thompson is one of the linemen with Duke Energy heading to Louisiana. They just left before 8 o'clock this morning. Thompson had just gotten back from the panhandle a couple of weeks ago after Hurricane Sally left thousands without power. The last time we went up there, it, it was pretty bad. But we, like we said, we do our best, we're safe, and get, just get the lights back on and come home just the same way we left here. The company is actually sending 165 crews from all over the state to the Gulf Coast. Duke Energy Director of Operation Glenn Watson says it's been a very busy hurricane season, but they are glad to be giving a helping hand. If you think about uh, what Louisiana is going through, you think about our 2004 and the storms and how they, they rolled in. So this is very, we, we understand the, the challenges that, that they have right now. Florida Power and Light deployed dozens of crews last night, adding that having boots on the ground before a storm is the fastest way to restore power. This is our job. This, this is our time to shine. This is our time to help help those in need. And this is how we give back to our communities, trying to be out there to get lights on as quickly and as safely and as efficiently as we can. So crews will be making a stop in the panhandle first before they head to Louisiana. And once the storm passes, they'll get there and they'll start working. In Winter Garden, Ezzie Castro getting results, News 6.